took a ride to LJ to look at some property. I think it was on the east side of LJ. It's about 20 minutes from the downtown LJ. So this is the ride in. Very kind of secluded, not a whole lot of neighborhoods around. Very peaceful. Think, yeah, very serene. We, uh, we, we, we liked, I think, if you looked off to the left, there was a running creek there or a river. These are all contributaries uh, from the top of this ridge. So these were all spring-fed creeks, just beautiful. Um, when we got to the property, we met up with the realtor, um, Jessica is her name. Um, so we'll introduce you to her, um, hopefully. Um, and this is still on the drive to the property. This is not on the property yet. See one of the neighbors there. That's one. The, look at that view. So they got they got a good view, but wait till you see. They the got views. some real pretty homes in the area. A lot of them are Airbnb. So here's the gate to the property. Um, yeah, we have a, well, we have a nice drive down. Um, so we'll get to the um, to the farmstead. Let's just uh, the house was uh, nice. Uh, I think the outside looks like what Rebecca a barn. Maybe yeah, it kind of looks like a big um, not so much a barn, but maybe more like a cabin or something. Cabin. It's got a big um, like covered area. Um, it's really here. nice. Guards are set up, ready to go. All the raised beds and fenced off. All a deep well, uh, spring, uh, all right here. So, just a beautiful little swath here. And there's irrigation in all of those beds, so you just turn that water on. You don't have to. Uh, I guess you can set it on a timer or whatever, whatever you're growing. Just going back to the house. I love the little wood. Uh, bottom there. Everything's been milled off the land, I, I think, what I heard her say. So, um, you can see, when we look back at some of the photos, you can see the land before they started building on it, and then as they started building a couple of sections, which is pretty cool. And by the way, the dogs did love it, didn't they? Oh, they had a great time. They, were, they didn't bark one time out there. They were just exploring. Yeah, they were, they were in the zone. So uh, the garden's fantastic already. Uh, let's go take a look in the house here a little bit. Um, I think the, uh, the there's some timbered wood. Can have a column. Have a column there. So here's the house, and it's kind of just a real basic open area here. This is kind of one little open room that would be a workshop, really. I mean, uh, but it's been zoned and licensed to live in. Yeah, it's move-in ready, like it's past okay. inspections and everything, so you can, you know, live there and just do the finishing touches or whatever. Got the loft up there, here's the bedroom, ready to go, um, and then uh, there's a little bathroom back here. So it's kind of set up right now as a one bedroom, one bath, with this big 
workshop area, and then a kitchen area. Right. Just give you a chance to get everything started. Here's the kitchen area back here. Um, and it's it, not big. I mean, it's just, you know, small kitchen area for starters. Yeah, and on the listing it says it's 800 square feet. But it seems bigger than that. I don't know. It's just because of that open big room. It's really tall. It has a tall, tall ceiling. I like the big sink, though. The farmhouse sink. Real shallow like that. And of course, we'll get rid of that thing as soon as possible. And there's some more of the garden here from the window, so it wouldn't be hard to look at that. Like I say, just real simple. It's just a starter house as a base is what we're thinking. Um, they actually had some plans of the garden and how it's laid out with some of the, uh, uh, the orchard that's already in place where it started. Um, so. They've done some really great plans to kind of show how things are laid out, that those will be helpful uh, in the future, potentially. Um, but just a really good, they, they were setting this property up as a homestead. Um, so that is uh, that's a pretty cool deal. Now, we did want to just take a look here. You can see the land kind of looking down. Um, oh, there you go. And that's the farmhouse there with the gardens off to the left. And all this is private road that we would own. Um, this is the, uh, wasn't sure if this is an outhouse or what it was. I had to go look and, oh, no, don't look away. <laughs> no, no, it was the, uh, this is the pump for the well. So that's a well pump. Um, that's just a, uh, they've got some heat and insulation on there. So that's cool. That's cool how they got it set up like that. You see the, this kind of goes back down towards the, as the property kind of slopes gently down. Uh, just fantastic. I mean, so much land to work with. It goes into a creek back here. Um, you know, some, uh, some of the woodworkings, just areas for build sites. Just about everywhere you look, there's just some incredible little build site areas. Little meadow glen. Yeah, that was really nice. And uh, you know, so I mean, ultimately, the property looks like got plenty of build sites. It's almost 50 acres. And and there, there's roads already established. There's old timber that we could harvest, make money with. There's uh, you know, food ready to grow. There's fresh water source, privacy. We didn't hear a vehicle the whole time. Yeah, it's pretty secluded. Yeah. It's checked off every single box so far. 20 minutes from LJ. Uh, I think it's... Maybe 30, 40, 40 to Blue Ridge. Ridge. Hour to Marietta, hour and a half to Atlanta. It's awfully, seems awfully close, but it's... It, it, it's Dis enough distance that the zombie herd won't make it there. <laughs> but anyway, here's some other areas that we want to. Right down the road is a uh, this little lake, which is just fantastic. I think we sent you a couple of pictures. Carter's Lake, yes, yeah, a dam, a big park. It's really pretty. Uh, it's so quiet there. I don't know if that's just because of what's going on. But... Yeah, so, so, you know, we're gonna see, man. This. this, this could be it. We might be able to talk them into 275. We're going to see what they say. And uh, see if this could be our view, you know. I think we can start a home. A homestead. A homestead. Love us. Love us. <laughs>